Hello, my name is Jeanette Chenero. I'm a personal trainer and group exercise instructor. Today I'm going to be outlining an activity you can do with your kids or students. This is a really fun activity. There's a big sense of competition and it also gets your children active. This is called, What Time Is It, Mr. Wolf? One child is designated as Mr. or Miss Wolf and they stand all the way on one end of the field, the playground, or the classroom. All the other children stand in one line up against um, the other end. So he is going to be Mr. or Mrs. Wolf, and the children are going to ask, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? And Mr. Wolf is going to either say 1 o'clock, 12 o'clock, 5 o'clock. Depending on what time he says, those are the number of steps that the children takes towards him. Now, whenever Mr. or Miss Wolf decides, when the child asks, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? The child says, it's dinner time. At that moment, Mr. Wolf is running towards the children and trying to catch one of them. And the children need to run back to the uh, starting spot. What time is it, Miss Wolf? It's three o'clock. What time is it, Miss Wolf? One o'clock. What time is it, Miss Wolf? Dinner time. So once the children all run back, whichever child gets caught, so they won't feel too bad about being caught, they actually have the opportunity to be Mr. or Miss Wolf. When coming up with activities for children, you have to keep in mind that children all have very different skills. Some may have physical skills. Some of them, however, may be a little bit more creative. So make sure you incorporate activities where every child can feel special. An activity that's great for creative children is instead of playing uh, charades with hand gestures, you can actually do it with clay. You can get modeling clay or Play-Doh and give the child an object. The rest of the team members can't know what this object is, but the child that got the name needs to go ahead and mold that object. It could be a wheel, a vase, let your imagination run wild. So these are two activities, both physical and creative, that you can outline for your children.